Yeah, what's up, you guys? This is Godson, and it is an incredible day today, you guys. Clan Wars has been officially announced, and me and the other YouTubers have had the chance to play it firsthand in Finland and tell you guys just how awesome this thing is. Now, we tried to hide it as best we could, but this is something everyone, including myself, has been waiting for for months and months and months, and they finally released it. And you guys, I can tell you, right now, this thing has met my expectations. So now I get to go over some of the features of Clan Wars to introduce you guys to this new feature coming out. But let me start by saying this is not something that's going to overtake regular gameplay. This is more of a add-on to complement Clash of Clans as it is already. So you guys will be happy farming and doing your regular gameplay while doing Clan Wars as well. So Supercell didn't really give us a limit on how many videos we can post about Clan Wars while we're advertising it to you. Uh, many of the other YouTubers will be presenting it as well if you guys want to check them out. So you guys, I'm going to try and break it down and give as best explanation as I can of what Clan Wars is and how it works. So the first thing I'm sure on your mind is how exactly are you matched up against other clans? Well, surprisingly, it doesn't go by trophies. And for very good reason. Supercell has pretty much fine-tuned the system and they've looked at both sides of the coin to see which direction works better for clan versus clan. So you guys, off the top of my head, these are the things I can remember they mentioned in our meeting with the dev team when they were explaining clan wars to us. So as you can see, you are matched up against other players that are the same or near the level of the heroes you have and that you've trained up, you will also be paired up with people that have somewhat same similar upgraded weapon levels, town hall levels, also the level of your walls, and the stats of your base. So this is a lot more detailed information that's going into the game rather than just trophy count. So what this means is basically you can be paired up with people on leaderboards, even uh, people at the very top on number one spot. And this all depends on how far you've progressed throughout Clash of Clans in your accumulation of upgrading and farming, etc. Now another thing you will notice is that you will also be matched up by the number of players in the other clan. So let's say, for example, a clan of 25 people will find a clan of 20. Well, what they do is they round the numbers by 5. So if a clan of 20 finds a clan of 25, they will round the number by 5s to make it even. So it would be 20 versus 20. Now, you guys, we've asked them every question we could think of. Uh, I think one we did ask them was, well, why don't you just have 100 people versus 100 people and just, you know, expand from there? Well, you know, they have already, again, looked at both sides and they've worked everything out. Even today, if you look at the clans on uh, leaderboards or even the bottom clans, a large majority of clans do not have full members. They are like 30 and or, or even 40 and below. So they match you by the number of your clans. So what about if somebody uh, goes into a clan war, if they join a war, and then they leave that clan and go to another clan to join that war? Well, they've worked that out as well, and what happens is there's a cooldown so that to prevent people from jumping to clan and clan hopping around and joining other wars, they give you a cooldown just to make sure everything is followed by the rules. Now, even though they are going to match as best they can each clan member that are equal to each other, you will have members that are probably lower than some of the enemies in the rival clan. But this is how strategy is worked out. So let's say if a really strong player just decides to dominate the weaker players, well then the weaker players are going to be left with strong players to fight with. So you have to coordinate with your clan exactly how this is going to work. Now the bonus for winning is going to go by loot, and you guys will be getting... Uh, I'll go into more detail about the loot and how that works, the new clan castle level, and uh, just exactly what the rewards are for winning against other clans. You guys, I can't tell you how proud I am of this game. We actually sat down for three hours just talking about possibilities and what we could add to the game now that Clan Wars is officially out. And yes, this also goes for the people that are doing the Nordic uh, Clash on the Facebook. This goes for them. They might have new features for maybe trophies or competing more clans against each other. Right now it's only clan versus clan, but who knows what the future may hold you guys. Uh, it just, it looks like a wonderful addition to the game and I'm really excited for it. Hopefully I could explain this best I can for you guys and get you pumped for it when it comes out. Thank you guys again, this is Godson. I'll see you next time.